What's up guys? Welcome back to our Mage Calamity playthrough. Fantastic. I know you love it so much. Me too. Welcome to the comment board. Okay. Starting off, we've got Noob Terrarian. First like, plus first comment. Edit. Oops, wrong account. It happens to the best of us. As you can see, I've done some work while I was away. We've got a nice little addition to the family. The product of love, I suppose. The reason I did that is I really needed the truffle because eventually I'm gonna need to get the uh, shroom my bars for something or other, maybe, I don't know. Uh, but mainly it was just me turning the jungle into a mushroom biome so I could get truffle worms easier. And truffle worms we have, and the only reason we would get that, okay, well, no more truffle I guess, is because I'm gonna fight Duke Krishron. And I'm very much hoping that because the whole world was messed up with the whole like 1.4 transition and everything that the ocean still works i mean it's a sulfuric ocean on both sides but i don't know if you can fight duke fisher on in the sulfuric ocean without him enraging so that's been on my mind i suppose hello thank you but we're gonna go ahead and give it a try and we'll see if that's the case hopefully not but possible so, as far as things to do, I have nothing to do other than- oh, don't look at that. I have nothing to do other than fight Duke Fishron, so we're gonna get right to that if I can. I imagine what'll happen is maybe if I just, like, can't do it, then maybe it'll, um... Have they changed the way that works? Did they change the way the water looks? They did, didn't they? Sulfuric poisoning. Okay, no, they reworked that. That's crazy. That looks cool, actually. Anyway, as I was saying, I think if it doesn't work, what will end up happening is probably just maybe, uh... It just won't bite the fishing line. Uh, but we'll hope that that doesn't happen. <laughs> uh, but I don't know what's gonna happen. We're giving it a try. Seems like it works to me. Whoa, okay. Damage. Damage. Definitely doable, but man, he, uh... Definitely reaches that second phase, or third phase, I guess, pretty quickly. I don't even think he was, like, down to a third of his health before he switched off. That's... Oh, gosh. Okay, anyway. I forgot to mention I could have made the, um... Miracle Fruit. Probably should have done that, but whatever. 25 extra health for me. Really? <laughs> okay, um, I'm just now realizing uh, I think they changed the amount of times he dashed in his last phase because I was going by the typical 1-2-3 pattern, but I'm pretty sure he um, does not abide by that anymore. Killer fish from San Diego. Alright, yeah, there we go. Sweet. 
And we got Mana Essence, imbued with magical power, smells a little like fish. What does that do for me? Unlimited mana? Yeah, I'll pass, buddy. Too cheaty for me. There you go, Duke Fishron. You can, uh... Be with the steampunker. I don't care. Anyway, that's out of the way. It's quick and easy. I... Ignore the times I died. Quick and easy. Flareon! Or Flareon. Whatever. Who cares? That didn't give me anything I wanted. So, uh... Angela, give me the fish. Hello. That gave me everything I wanted. Okay, never mind. We're good. Now, I would say that um, razor blade typhoon. Eh, I feel like the Empress and Duke Fish run weapons are kind of on par. They're not like too far apart, as far as I know. Could be wrong though. But we've got the uh, razor blade typhoon now, which is supposedly really good. Could be better. Just saying. Now the bubble gun. It is what it is. Uh, but yes, the razor blade typhoon does do an insane amount of damage. Yeesh. Do I have a Xeno popper on me? I swear I had one. I do. Okay, yeah. So I can upgrade this, like, as soon as Moon Lord's over. Okay. Well. Looks good to me. Looks like we're doing good. Blazing through this. Can't wait to hit another part of the grind session. Which should come... I guess after Moon Lord or Profane Guardians. Or Providence. I don't know. There's a grind session somewhere in there. But for the most part, it's just bosses from now on. You know what? I'll be honest. It's not the most damaging thing I have. It's homing, which is nice. And it has a lot of singer's heart damage, but I mean... Ah, yeah, I think it's outclassed, actually. Oh, no. Poor razor blade. Pour one out for my homie. Anyway, so, basically... What's up next? Uh, cultist man. Also known as, uh, lunatic cultist. We're just speedrunning today. There's really nothing else I can do. Hey guys, how's it going? Oh yeah, I forgot. For some reason I just didn't feel like making a Skeletron Arena, so I just let it over. That was fun. Those were good times. That was a long time ago. I'm trying to wait for it to get a bit brighter so that y'all can see better. I know, uh, watching YouTube videos, especially Terraria, it can be really dark sometimes. We are ready to fight this man. Oh, okay. Well, I wasn't aware you could be frozen by that guy. I've mentioned this like every other episode. I, I like, I know I have. I remember every time. But it is constantly raining. This entire series has just been rain. Okay, guys, let's not be silly this time.
Ah, I gotta get out of here. Go away, bugs. I hate you. Close one. Close call. Why are you on top of the tree? Why would you do that? Holy crap, Captain America. That's a... Oh. Melee time. Welcome to the pillar event. Where I'm probably gonna have to fight 150 enemies because... You know. This isn't 1.4.4. Unless they already balanced that for Calamity or something, I don't know. Looks like it's going pretty fast, actually. Oh wow, yeah, I'm... This, this shouldn't take long at all. Unless I die. Entirely possible, by the way. I could farm for Nebula, but I could also not. I'm gonna do the latter, I think. You can stop shooting me now. The pillar's, the pillar's over, you can stop shooting. Yeesh. I apologize if I'm speeding through the whole pillar event. Uh... It's the pillar event. I think we all know the pillar event. Hmm, new magic weapon. Interesting. Oh yeah, the cosmic rainbow. I know that guy. Well, I can go ahead and make like 15 new magic weapons right now, so. Alright. Lay it on me. There you go, cultist. Dude thinks he's so cool. He's not. He's not. Alright, we've got... I completely forgot about this one. What? Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. Okay, well... New weapon just dropped. Uh... Yep. No problem. Now, the real question is, do I want... The Tome of Fates, or do I want... I can't even make the other thing, can I? No, I don't. Do I have the Cosmic Rainbow? It doesn't matter. Ah, I see. Okay. And that'll be used to make either the Augur Elements or the Tactician's Trump card. I guess it's not that hard to make. I could make it for either, couldn't I? Yeah, don't worry about it. Nuclear Fury will be after Moon Lord. And that'll be swagging. Uh, but I'm most interested in this. And it's it's just an upgraded version of what I had. <laughs> yeah. Not... Super surprising. Just get everything to mythical. Why not? Take all of my money. And we'll just, um... Go ahead and replace all of our weapons again. Solar Pillar is as usual. It is what it is. Uh, but this Arc Amerilis, I guess is what it's called. Pretty good. NGL. I'll just, uh, be here. 1600 damage. Okay. Okay. Oh, Lord. That is damage. Okay. I got hit by a Nebula Blaze. For 461 damage. Okay. There we go. We're using this now because I know this won't be deflected. My hood isn't doing a whole lot of healing. Okay. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I'm good at games. Trust me. Crawl to beat central. Thank you. Leave this plane of existence. What am I supposed to do Astrum Deus, by the way? Ah, uh, before Moon Lord. Interesting. Do you mind, buddy? Look at you and your new sprite. Who cares? Didn't ask. Look at me, I'm Big Brain. Shut up. I hate Markiplier reference. Why is the bloom so bright? Alright, so let's take a look and see why I can't make Cosmic Rainbow. It hurts my feelings that I can't make Cosmic Rainbow. I don't have a Pearl Wood Bell, really. Interesting. Okay, that's the problem here. 
I think I am a dementia patient. What was I doing? I remember. I remembered. Please hold your applause. I remembered what I was going to do. How did I completely forget that I was trying to make the cosmic rainbow? I was looking at it and I was like, alright, yeah, time to go get the stuff. And then I took like two steps to the left and I was like, where am I going? It's not my day. Hopefully that's not a sign of anything. Alright, here we go. Life alloy. Swag. And cosmic rainbow. Actually, nope, never mind. I need to make the bow first. The pearlwood bow. Whose existence deals extra enemy deals extra damage to enemies shot at point blank range. Who Okay. I guess this is just a change all the bows got uh, from Calamity, I guess. I don't know. Okay! Now, why did I favorite the mushroom? No. This is a very important mushroom. No, it's not. That is a lot of mana. That is a lot of ugly. That hurts my eyes. Interesting. That's very <laughs> interesting. Uh, worth getting? Questionable? Hey, twins, get out here. You're my test dummies. Uh... I guess it's mainly for crowd control purposes. That's what I'm chalking it up to. And then this just does a lot of damage. Okay, yeah. Good weapons. Good weapons. Good answer. Fantastic. <laughs> Alright, so the astral biome is over to the right. I'll tell you what I'll do. I think the plan's gonna be... We'll go ahead, take out the Bin Chippy. Binly Mega Mega Chippy Pillar. Because we can't have the Stardust Pillar holding Binly Mega Chippy hostage. It, my man does not deserve that. Justice for Binly Mega Chippy. Hands off, you scoundrels. We'll just, uh... Yeesh, razor blade. Calm down. I didn't want you to kill all of them. I once again stashed my hood. Okay, fantastic. Really wish there was a way to favor armor and be able to switch it without, you know, unfavoriting it. I don't know why that what happens. Ow. This is gonna be a very exciting episode. I I know the um pillars are just the most riveting thing to watch. Just as exciting to watch as they are to play. Otherworldly voices linger around you. Me when I smell that Zaza. Could the Twinkles watch it? Could the could the Twinkles back off a little bit? I have to go grab all of that Stardust now because it bothers my OCD and I'll feel bad if I don't get it. I hope you're happy with yourself. I don't care about the Astral Biome. Go tell your mother. She'll care. Hi, buddy. Do you need something? Yeah? Okay. Alright, so next we just need to do some Astrum Dias time. Even though the lunar event is supposedly before Astrum Theus. I don't understand how that works. I, I'm guessing that's a mistake. So I don't know whether I should do the lunar event or Astrum Deus first. Because I don't know, does Astrum Deus get buffed after Moon Lord's defeated or does that Astrum Oris? That's Astrum Oris, never mind, never mind. Forget what I'm saying, I'm an idiot. I'll tell you what, we're doing Moon Lord today. I also need to refill on my potions. Yeesh, I've been dying so much, I've just been using so many of them. I need my drugs! I need my drugs. Give me the heroin. I'm taking back the dungeon, you thieves. You will rue the day that you chose to mess with me. Don't you know who I am? Ash Locks. A-S-H-L-O-K-S. Oh yeah, that's right. Can't handle the heat, can you? Get out of the kitchen then. 
Never been a huge fan of bugs, personally. Actually, quite the opposite. Bugs are freaky. Uh, if you're afraid of bugs, don't let other people know that. Because then anytime they find a bug, and they are they happen to be a person who isn't afraid of bugs, they'll be like, you know, something really funny I could do. Is I could grab this bug, and I could, I could throw it at this person, or put it on the person that said that they are afraid of bugs. Because I am sadistic for some reason. I enjoy seeing others suffer. Okay, what y'all? There's a lot of y'all. Just saying, overpopulation's a real problem, you know. Do your part. Uh, yeah, I don't have enough time. Let's buff up, head home, and uh, win. We're gonna win. We're gonna win. Nurse, where are you? I need you. Desperately. There we go. There's my giant pathway. Moon Lord should be here, like, right now. Hello, twins. Pair of eyeballs! There he is. Perish. Okay, that was not already a bad start. Yep, okay, well, uh, I was operating under the assumption that whenever I, um, killed his top eye that he would stop his giant death laser. Uh, that didn't happen. Clearly in Calamity, his, um, his eyes and his hand eyes don't really pop out. But you know what? It gives me time to make more magic weapons. Now we have the... Lays hard. Oh lord. I love the way that sounds on my ears. I'm gonna try it one more time. We're gonna try it one more time.
Is he dead? Uh, that's a lot of, that's a lot of chat messages. Ah, oh, credits. We did it. We've deep terrari. Oh, no. We beat Terraria. Fantastic. What did I get? Everything. But my- oh, 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 oh my gosh! Cat cart! Moon Lord Relic! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh lord. What a guy. And I got like... Everything but a magic weapon. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Got a Celebration Mark II. Got a Terrarian for whatever reason. Thanks. Guess what? More accessory slots. <laughs> and now is where the big boy crafting recipes come in. Oh lord. Get started with some effervescence. Mm. Oh my gosh. It's beautiful. I also need to get the Nebula armor, of course. But uh, that'll be next episode. I'll give you a sneak peek of these weapons, though. We've got the uh, sluggish... Oh, uh, well. Okay. Whoa! Uh, what does this do? I've never used this before. Whoa! Bubbles! And then, of course... Ah! It is what it is. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, please. I really want to... Oh. Yes. This is what I wanted. <laughs> oh, I got so excited I just tapped out of my game. This is what we like to see. <laughs> Anyway, now we're into the late game, basically, as you can see by the fact that I am absolutely destroying Moon Lord now. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.